and my name's Diane. And today we're going to be testing out two ways to make your Easter eggs. So we're going to try these cool kits called Egg Amazing. You can get these at Target, Walmart, Justice, or Amazon. But we got these from our Aunt Carla. Hi Aunt Carla! I just opened my box and this is all the stuff that came in it. So we got the instructions. Uh, we got these darker colors and the, like the more neon colors. I like like these colors better because I really don't like like pink and red and orange and yellow. I'm more like like the blue and like purple. This is the machine that's a little bit hard to take out. This is what the machine looks like. I'm gonna get started. First, I'm gonna put the egg inside the machine. Then I'm gonna turn it on. It might be a little bit noisy. Then we're gonna grab the color marker that we want. I'm gonna use this really pretty purple. Now I'm gonna use this really pretty blue. While well, it's making a really cool design. Yeah. Some toothpicks and some dye. So the first thing, oh, 
And eggs. <laughs> and eggs. So you're gonna give it a little squirt. A little more than a squirt. And then, can you pass the whipped cream to me? Oh yeah. <laughs> Thank you. And then I'm gonna paint my three favorite colors, but you can use two or one. I, but I suggest you use um, like three or two because one, it's just gonna be a one solid color. So now I'm gonna use these three colors, yellow, orange, and red. So I'm gonna give it one, two squirts of yellow because yellow is not that, is not that dark. I'm gonna give it two squirts, but little drops. And I'm gonna use turquoise, a hot pink, and um, a really pretty purple. So now I'm going to do one drop of orange. I'm gonna do one drop of turquoise. Or actually two. And then red is really dark, so I'm gonna use only one. Again. And I'm gonna use two drops of purple. There we go. So you won't mix it too much or else it'll turn one solid color. So I'm just gonna do this with the toothpick and um yeah, I'm gonna mix this with the toothpick and make sure you're not mixing it too much or else it'll turn one solid color. And I really don't want that and I hope you don't either. <laughs> so now I'm gonna do mine and I really like the colors that I chose. So these are our this is what my color looks like. It's kind of orange, yellowish, and I really like it. This is what my color looks like. It's kind of like a purplish, reddish, bluish. So now you're gonna take your egg and then swirl it around in here. But um, even the, even though you're not mixing it with the toothpick, it'll still um, make one solid color, and you don't want that. So you can also, instead of swirling it, you can also dab it in there. And, um, yeah. I think mine looks like a galaxy. And I'm going to place it on this cardboard so it dries. Mine also looks like, um, a sunset. And it's really cool. It's all done. So now I'm going to place it on, um, on the cardboard. Okay, guys. So now I'm going to squirt the um, whipped cream in here like last time. And so am I. I'm going to squirt just a little. So I'm going to use Easter colors. So I think I'm going to use pink, orange, and yellow. No. <laughs> okay. So, oh no. So my pants. Okay, so she made a mess squirting it in her mouth. So I'm gonna put that over there so that doesn't happen again. And I'm gonna use orange, this hot pink, but I'm gonna like use a little because I don't want it to be like a very hot pink because I don't think that's like a real Easter color. I think it's like a little light pink. And then I'm gonna use yellow. Oh! She's done with the yellow, so I'm gonna take that yellow and use um just one drop again. Um. And then I'm going, and then um, I'm going to use um, some pink. How do you think your egg's going to turn out? Cool. I mean, two pink. drops of pink. And, and then I'm going to maybe use one more drop of yellow because I did two drops of pink. Okay. So now I'm gonna get my toothpick and, and I'm going to swirl it around. And again, you don't wanna mix it too much or, or else it'll give it one solid color. So I'm just mixing and mixing and mixing and mixing. So we just let our eggs sit for 15 to 30 minutes, and now we're gonna pat them down with the um, paper towel. Paper towel. So now we're gonna grab an egg. I think I don't want to get my. I don't think I want to get a dye, so I'm gonna grab it like this. Yeah, me too. I'm gonna grab. I, you know what? I think I might wipe the color off. Oh yeah. So <laughs> I'm just gonna grab it with my hand. 
Wow. It's actually like not as. And then I'm gonna put it right here, right? Oh, and then. Oh, okay. It's just sticky. That's not. Good. And then Sorry. I'm gonna like pat it down so it can get brighter. It feels weird. It does. It's like sticky. But I don't know why. Oh, whipped cream. That's why. I think I'm gonna do like mostly all the color of mine. Yeah. How about you? I mean, I'm really scared if I, if I um, wipe all the color off. I mean, it's not like you're wiping all the color off. Nah, it's not, but still. Look, there's pink right there. I know. <laughs> it touched. That's actually cool. And now, like, this is like an orange pinkish color. Uh, comment down below if you're excited for Easter. Because I am. Candy. Comment down below which egg do you like out of mine. I think my Me favorite too. one would be. Um. Hmm. I think my favorite one would be this one. Mm. And out of hers, I think my favorite one would be this one. Even so though my favorite gonna, color is blue. So now I'm going to dry off her favorite of mine. We just finished doing the second wave with the whipped cream and the dye. And what I liked about the what I liked about the these eggs are that they all have like different styles and all different colors, which I like because I'm like a colorful person. And this way, I like it because like you can be creative and you can do a lot of designs with them. And I think I liked this way more because like there was a little bit more designs. I couldn't figure out a lot of ways how to do some designs on, designs on this one, but I could do a lot of designs on this one. The thing I liked about these were that they're so colorful and I'm a colorful person too. And well, this one's not so colorful, but I still like it. And the um, thing I like about these is that like, they have like a swirl and like lines and stuff, and I like swirls and lines. And I think I liked um, that way more because it, it's just really cool. And I mean, look at this.